Tom Bow Station, this is the GTFR Hawkins requesting permission to duck. Tom Bow Station to Hawkins, we read you. You are cleared for approach at Pylon S1. Stand by for ADT transmission. All units, we have an incoming jump signature. IFF unknown. Launch everything you have now and begin evac procedures. All units, prepare to defend and escort. Understood, Myrmidon. We, we are preparing to launch transports and escape pods now. Myrmidon, we are heavily outnumbered! We are launching the reserve fighters now. Hang in there, pilot. Alpha wing, beta wing, take out those cannons. Mermidon, this is Alpha Leader. Our weapons are ineffective. There's some sort of shielding on this vessel. GDC Odin and GTC Barrel on station. We are engaging the unknown warship. Myrmidon, GTC Aegis here. We can confirm Alpha 1's readings. Weapon systems have no impact on this vessel shielding. Requesting immediate mission update. Myrmidon, we need a mission update. We are detecting a large number of bombers launching from the warship. We do not have enough fighters to intercept. Helm, time to jump drives ready. We'll be jump ready in three minutes, sir. We don't have three minutes. Where's the nearest GTI detachment? The GTD Krios is in Atari, sir. Send an encrypted transmission to the Krios. All combat records of our current engagement must get through. No! Damn it. 
This is the Myrmidon to all remaining fighters. Engage enemy bombers and buy us time. Jump in two minutes. What happened here? Command, we have arrived at Tombaugh Station. There's nothing left but debris. Alpha Wing, can you confirm the status of the GTD Myrmidon? Affirmative, Command. Orion pieces are among the debris. We are deploying the GTSC Demeter to your position. Stand by. The Demeter will perform a deep scan of the debris field. Your objective is to maintain a patrol of and secure the area until the Demeter has finished its mission. This is the GTSC Demeter, powering up our scanners now. Command, we have detected a large ship with no orbit around Ribos 4. Data is consistent with the warship sighted by the GTD Myrmidon. Gamma Wing, we are redeploying you to perform the reconnaissance on the unknown vessel. Sending jump coordinates now. Roger, Command. Proceeding to jump coordinates now.
Incoming Shivan fighters, break and attack. Breaking to attack. Heads up, we have company. managed to download data from a few inactive probes that were still intact. He had detected three large pieces of debris which may house vital combat data. These pieces are in a decaying orbit. If we're going to attempt recovery, now is the time. Understood, Demeter. We are deploying a recovery team. Alpha and Beta, provide cover. Beta. We are securing the package for subspace transit. Gamma, we are securing the package now. Affirmative, sir. Attacking your target. I'm on it. Attacking. 
working now, sir. Rearming complete, sir. I'm on it. New bandits. Alpha wing, Shivan bomber wing inbound. They're targeting us. Please assist. Recovery complete. We are preparing to jump. Alpha, we have faint signal coming from... We have a Kane class cruiser jumping in. Heads up, we have come... Could one of you fly boys give me... That's no Kane Alpha. Krios, we have a new cruiser class here. Engaging enemy. Roger, disregard... Get out of there, Demeter. Alpha and Beta, protect the Demeter. Reinforcements are on the way. Jump in 40 seconds. Epsilon Wing has arrived. Engaging enemy. Roger, disregarding your target. Affirmative, sir. Affirmative, sir. Attacking your target. Affirmative, sir. Attacking your target. Losing systems. Help me out. New bandits in the area. Attacking now, sir. Engaging now, sir. This is Delta Wing. We are engaging the Shivan cruiser. Attacking now, sir. Attacking now, sir. Affirmative, sir. Attacking, Attacking now, your sir. target. Roger, sir. On our way. Affirmative, sir. Attacking your target. The cruiser has jumped out, Command. Transmitting new jump coordinates. All wings return to base. 
Rearming sequence aborted. something looks like an Athena bomb. Command, I've located a heavily damaged Athena among the debris, detecting faint life signs. We are deploying SAR. Stand by. This is Sar Alpha. We are moving in to dock with the Athena. Star Alpha here, recovery successful. We are undocking now. We managed to recover all the essential data in the area. The information provided by these recovered assets, coupled with the information from the GTD Myrmidon, will be vital to piecing together precisely what happened at Tombow Station. We believe the Shebans were aware of Tombow Station before the attack, but data on the black boxes contained in the debris suggest there were no registered Sheevan fighters arriving at the station before the attack. The Sheevan cruiser you encountered has been designated the SC Lilith. Preliminary results from the Demeter scans show this cruiser is considerably more armored with greater firepower than a cane. Not even our Leviathans can match this new threat, so we are classifying it as an A-class threat. If the Sheevans have a large quantity of this cruiser, they will pose a great threat to the GTA. The pilot we recovered from the Athena is currently being treated for his injuries. Although we could not recover any of the data in his Athena, we believe we can glean some information from our investigation on the Lucifer Destroyer once he has recovered. Well done. We have designated the ship that destroyed Tombow Station and the GTD Myrmidon as the SD Lucifer. Information gathered from the Myrmidon indicates that the warship has powerful forward mounted flux cannons and a shield system that resisted all conventional attacks from our Fenris and Leviathan cruisers. This shielding even negated damage from our Phoenix 4 anti-cruiser missiles. The GTD Bastion, the GTD Galladay, and the PVD Pinnacle are currently en route to Rybos. But it will be a few hours before they arrive. For the time being, we need you to lay low and be on guard. Get some rest, pilot. You're gonna need it. Three hours ago, we received an intelligence report from the Vasudan Directorate. The Shivans have invaded the GTA-controlled system of Rybos. They report that civilian and military casualties are high, and evacuation of the system is now highly likely. 
Since we are already in Antares for our diplomatic mission, we are being deferred to provide assistance in these operations. The GTA has informed us of the existence of a new class of Shivan destroyer, which jumped in and eliminated Tombaugh Station along with all its defenses in a matter of minutes. As you may know, one cruiser from our fleet, the PVC Asim, and two wings of fighters were assigned to escort our contingent of scientists and technicians that were invited to Tombaugh for a joint project. Our warriors died honorably defending Tombaugh Station from the overwhelming force of the Siobhan attack. Preliminary reports indicate this vessel, designated the SD Lucifer, was employing some sort of large coverage shielding system, similar to the one present on their fighters and bombers. This high yield shield seems all but completely impervious to all our weapons. We are to avoid contact with the Lucifer at all costs. Our objective in Rebos is search and rescue. We must escort civilian and damaged military ships back to Antares while the GTA conducts offensive operations against the Shivans. Additionally, we have information that some Vasudans managed to escape from Tombaugh. Recovering them will be our top priority. We will launch our wings in one hour, warriors. Report to your stations and await your squadron briefings. Attention pilots. We have a dangerous situation developing, so I'll be briefing your squadron personally. We received a distress signal from a large convoy carrying Tombaugh station survivors. They have come under attack by the Hammer of Light and are in need of immediate assistance. Though we have had no record of HOL activity in this system, we deployed a wing of fighters to investigate. Just 10 minutes ago, we received another message from the convoy. The situation is deteriorating quickly. They are under attack by Hammer of Light ships, and the wing we sent to assist the convoy has turned traitor, defecting to the HOL. They have begun attacking both Vasudan and Terran ships in the area. High and Omicron wings, you are going in. Your objectives are to destroy any Hammer of Light forces in the area, survey the situation, and secure the convoy while awaiting our arrival. The Pinnacle cannot leave its position at the Antares jump node until reinforcements arrive. So your squadron will have to maintain the area until we can provide support. Be advised that all our wings are on a constant rotation, assisting other civilian and military convoys throughout the system. The Shivans are attacking on multiple fronts, and our forces are stretched thin, so we have limited reinforcements available. Savasuda. Destroyers are coming. There is but one way, and soon you will all see the truth. This is Pi and Omicron wings from the PVD Pinnacle. We are moving in to assist. Thanks for your assistance, Pi and Omicron. The HOL fanatics might return at any moment. As you wish. Can you tell us what happened, Pilly? How did the Hammer of Light ships manage to infiltrate Remos? It was subterfuge, Pi. We were part of the team invited to Tombaugh Station when the Shivans attacked. These lunatics took control of our ships through force after we escaped the combat area. We do not know much more, other than some of the pilots that were escorting us defected and began to attack everyone that refused to swear reverence to the old scriptures. Understood, Peely. The Pinnacle is inbound to our location to provide assistance. It will be some time before it arrives.
Affirmative. By the destroyers, your soul will be cleansed. Incoming enemy targets. The Shivans know our location now. We have to protect the convoy until the pinnacle arrives. Everyone on high alert. Docking complete. All personnel are now boarding our transport. Incoming enemy targets. Engaging enemy. All personnel from the ship are now aboard our transport. Undocking now.
Director, we just repelled a large ship and attack wave, requesting additional support. As you wish. All wings are currently engaged, Pi. We are requesting support from the GTA. Please stand by. It seems we are on our own. Stay vigilant, pilots. Rearm and repair if you need to. Shivan strike cruiser with fighter and bomber escort have just jumped in. All wings, protect the convoy. Engaging enemy, disregarding your target. Enemy target is behind you. Delta Wing from the GTD Galatea is available to assist. Call them in at your discretion, pilots. This is Delta Wing, ready to assist. Engaging now, sir. Ships have returned. Watch out for those fighters, but focus on the Shivans. How did the Hammer of Light infiltrate rivals? Affirmative. Disregarding your target. We do not know that. We will ruminate on these questions after the threat has been dealt with. Enemy presence detected. Good kill! Enemy presence detected. 
Another ship and cruiser has just arrived. Breaking to attack. Engaging now, sir. Attempting to breach hull. PVD pinnacle ready to assist. Halfway through the hull. Marines, check your weapons. Prepare to engage. Target required. Engaging enemy. Enemy wing just arrived! Cold wing deployed. This is all we have, pilot. All breached. Entering ship now. One is clear. Engaging now, sir. Deck two is clear. Great shot! As you Area is secure. We are preparing to deploy transports to assist the convoy. Threats on deck three neutralized. Delta Wing, we have the situation under control. You may return to base. Confirm clear. Deck five is clear. Command, the ship is ours. Boarding team, fan out and search for other tangos. Pi and Omicron, you are cleared to land. Weapons depleted, calling for support. Excellent work. Most of the convoy was saved and we will be escorting them to the Antares jump node once the Pinnacle finishes providing support to other convoys in need of assistance. Admiral Imutef himself congratulates you on a job well done. This is a great honor, pilot. However, not all went according to plan. The GTA has ordered a complete retreat and evacuation of all Vasadon and Terran civilian and military personnel from the Ribo system. We have a hard fight ahead of us getting everyone out safely. That was quick thinking in capturing that Hammer of Light ship. We managed to recover some survivors that were hiding inside, and we will be able to interrogate the captured HOL militants. We commend you on your diligence and sound judgment.
Due to our delay in Beta Cygni, we will arrive in Rybos in two hours. We are going to split our fighter complement in two. One half will be assigned to convoy protection. The Shivans are reportedly everywhere in the system and civilians on their way out of the system are coming under attack. We must get them out safely. This task will be carried out with the cooperation of an allied Vasuting destroyer, the PVD Pinnacle, operating in Rybos which will be in charge of civilian protection. The other half of our complement will be assigned to an offensive operation at the IKEA Jump Node, the details of which I've just finished discussing with the Admiral. We will be using our entire battle group to take control of the node and then intercept Shivan reinforcements coming from IKEA. This operation will be vital in supporting all other GTA and PVN operations in the system by cutting off enemy forces and defying the Shivan war machine. By the time we arrive in Rybos, our forces from the Krios and Bastion battlegroups will already be engaged with the Lucifer Super Destroyer currently in orbit above Rybos 4. GTA High Command has issued a standing order to completely evacuate the Rybos system should this operation fail. Should this come to pass, our blockade of the IKEA jump node will be recalled and we will commit all of our efforts to civilian protection. We will be monitoring the situation and will provide mission updates as needed. Two wings will be deployed to spearhead the operation of the IKEA jump node, while the rest will be on standby and be deployed as the situation in Rybos develops. Report to your squadron leaders for your mission briefings. Dismissed. Sky, a moment. I have a special mission for you. Commander Harbison has selected our squadron for a special operation at the IKEA jump node. Our battlegroup is to blockade the jump node and intercept incoming Shivan vessels. Command believes that cutting off Shivan reinforcements will be the key to the success of our other operations in the system, so our entire battlegroup is being trusted with this mission. Our scouts report that the IKEA jump node is protected by an array of sentry guns, two cane cruisers and six fighters. This operation will be divided into two phases. For phase 1, the GTC Neptune, escorted by Zeta Wing, will jump through the IKEA jump node out of range of the sentry guns. Commander Harbison believes that by posing the smallest credible threat, the Shivans will leave their position at the node to attack the Neptune directly. Once the Neptune has engaged both Shivan cruisers, we will sortie the GTC Orf and the GTC Gladiator along with the Iota Wing to finish the job and take control of the jump node. Zeta and Iota, your orders are to stay close and provide assistance to the cruisers while they carry out this operation. Under no circumstances are you to engage the Shivan ships on your own. For phase 2, our cruisers will take firing positions near the node and the GTD Galatea will arrive to take control over the blockade. Once on station, the Galatea will deploy Kappa and Theta wings on fighter patrol. Additional wings will be on standby and may be deployed as the situation develops. Since we do not have additional cruiser assets available for our operation, two allied Vasudan warships from the Pinnacle Battlegroup. The PVC Nownet and the PVC APEP will be joining us. The GTA will have command authority over this joint operation and we are responsible for the safety of our Vasudan allies. The Galatea will be closely monitoring the situation and mission updates will be provided in operation. Good luck, pilots. This is the GTC Neptune. We are moving to engage the Shivans. Pilots, keep your distance with those cruisers. Do not take unnecessary risks. Affirmative, sir. It looks like we got their attention. The Shivans are closing in on our position.
to attack. Engaging enemy. We are chasing. Gladiator, don't get too far ahead. Beta and Iota wings, provide assistance while we engage the convoy. Enemy wing just arrived! Some of the convoy managed to jump away, Command. Understood, Zeta. We are commencing Phase 2 now. Stand by. This is the GTD, Galate. We are moving to take control of the blockade. Launching additional wings now. Rearming complete, sir. Affirmative, sir. Upper wing here, standing by.
This is Theta Wing. We are moving to escort position. Enemy wing just... We are picking up Sheevan fighters emerging from the jump node. All ships engage. Sir, calling in for repair! Engaging now, sir. Roger, sir. On our way. Enemy wing just arrived! Losing systems! Help me out! Two Shivan transports have arrived from Ikea. Both sheep and transports have been destroyed. Well done, pilots. Rearming complete, sir. This is Epsilon Wing returning to base. Mission accomplished. Excellent work, Sky. Assist the captain. Stand by for further orders. Admiral Wolf, this is Captain Irwin of the GTC Aegis. We understand that the GTI has declared our ship as AWOL, and we are here to turn ourselves in. Weapons are offline. Yes, sir. Acknowledged, Captain Irwin. We are dispatching a boarding team to establish direct contact. Stand by to be boarded. Understood. GTC agent standing by. More fighters jumping in. Engaging enemy. Enemy wing 
just arrived. Great shot. Taking damage. Request cover. Roger, sir. On our way. Another Shivan transport has just arrived. out the SC right. Galatea, this is Omega Wing returning to base. Requesting priority landing. Omega Wing, you are cleared to land. Emergency teams are on standby. Roger, sir. On our way. Yes, sir. Say, this is the GTD Creos. The assault is not going as planned. We are preparing to disengage and proceed with the evacuation of Rybox. Please acknowledge. Acknowledged, Creos. We will proceed with the evacuation as planned. Rearming complete, sir. The Shivans are making another push. Do not allow them to escape. New hostiles in the area! Engaging now, sir. Could one of you fly boys give me some cover? Just a 
rock pilots, those basilisks are moving to engage our cruisers. Intercept them. Roger, sir. On our way. Complete, sir. A demon class destroyer has just arrived. All ships disengage and prepare to jump. Pilots, fall back to cover our retreat. Roger, disregarding your target. Heads up, we have company. This is the GTD Galaxy. A demon class destroyer has just jumped in from Ikea. We cannot hold our position any longer. We are withdrawing. Roger, disregarding your target. 
knowledge, Galate. Proceed to rendezvous point Echo and regroup. We are transmitting jump coordinates. All ships jump to the rendezvous point. Impressive, pilot! This operation was a success. We managed to keep the Shivans at bay long enough to see several convoys safely to their destination and we dealt a heavy blow to the enemy force at the Battle of Rebus IV. Unfortunately, we had no way to hold our position after the Demon Class Destroyer arrived. Some of our ships were heavily damaged, but the worst was the loss of our fighter wings. We don't have enough pilots available for a proper combat rotation and pushing the offensive any longer would have surely led to a catastrophic number of casualties. Good job keeping both Vasuvan cruisers safe. Admiral Emutev has already contacted Admiral Wolf to express his gratitude for our assistance and to commend your excellent piloting skills and seeing to the safety of his ships. We must come together if we are going to have any chance of defeating the Shivans, and your actions today will help ensure a promising future of cooperation and a strong alliance between our two species. Command has ordered the complete evacuation of all civilian and military personnel from the Rivus system. Our focus must now be on getting all persons out of the system alive. We have little time to rest, pilot. Next briefing is in one hour. Dismissed. As you already know, we are on our way to the Rybos system to link up our battle group with the GTI 12th battle group led by the GTD Cryos for an upcoming operation codenamed Tsunami. We are waiting for confirmation from GTA High Command and I will brief you on the details of this upcoming operation when we arrive. Our entire fighter complement will take part in this operation. All wings are on alert level 30 and will await further orders. Dismissed. Good afternoon, pilots. Please, take your seats. We just got the green light from GTA High Command, and we have a lot of work ahead of us today. The GTI has located the Shivan Super Destroyer, designated the SD Lucifer in stable orbit around Rybos 4. We plan to mount a large-scale offensive using the recently introduced Medusa bombers and the new type of bomb known only as Project Tsunami. According to preliminary intelligence data acquired from the Tomba station attack, a single Orion-class destroyer has no chance in a direct confrontation with the SD Lucifer. So our battle group will join the GTI 12th battle group, led by the GTD Cryos, for this upcoming operation. The attack will proceed as follows. Task Force Alpha, consisting of the GTC Monitor, GTC Atla, and GTC Baldar, will launch an offensive on the left flank of the Lucifer. Intelligence data suggests that the bulk of the Lucifer's firepower should be concentrated on the front of the ship, and that this area should prove relatively safe if we keep our distance. The Lucifer is currently protected by two Kane-class cruisers, the SC Vias and the SC Senna, as well as an unknown number of fighters on board the Lucifer itself. Task Force Alpha's primary objective is to establish space superiority over the Sheevans and decimate their ranks to pave the way for the second phase of our operation. We will not directly engage the SD Lucifer and only engage the cruisers if we can lure them away from their current position. To establish space superiority, we will deploy over half the Bastions and Cryos' fighter complement. Zeta, Omega, Kappa, Eta, Sigma, and Upsilon Wing. You will be assigned to Task Force Alpha. You will join up with Alpha, Beta, Gamma, Delta, and Epsilon Wing from the GTD Cryos. The Cryos battle group will be in command of Task Force Alpha and all wings will follow the orders given by Alpha 112 of the Cryos. As I already mentioned, our objective is not to directly engage the SD Lucifer. But if the Lucifer moves to engage our cruisers, 
we will be forced to abort this attack immediately and all ships are to return to base. If everything goes according to plan, Task Force Beta will be deployed half an hour after Task Force Alpha's launch to relieve them, and we will begin the second phase of our operation. During the second phase, three more cruisers will be deployed. The GTC Hammer, the GTC Tear, and the GTC Fitch from our battle group, alongside Alpha, Beta, Gamma, Delta, and Epsilon wings. We will be in command of Task Force Beta, and I will personally lead this assault. Our task will be to clear a path for our bombers while maintaining space superiority. We do not know how many fighters will be on board the Lucifer, so be prepared for a long and arduous battle. During this phase, the GTC Bastion and GTC Cryos will jump in at a safe distance to start the final phase of this operation. If the Sheevan's sortie bombers to engage our destroyers, it will be our task to intercept them. The GTD Cryos will deploy four wings of Medusa bombers, armed with the experimental Tsunami bomb. Our job at this stage will be to escort those bombers to their target. Data from the Tomba attack suggests the SD Lucifer is protected by shield technology, the same technology used in Sheevan fighters and bombers, but at a larger scale and impervious to all of our weapons. Even the Phoenix 4 anti-cruiser missile is insufficient. Intelligence believes we might be able to brute force our way through the shield by using the new Tsunami bombs. If this is true, then we will be looking at a long assault, so keeping those bombers alive during their rearm runs will be critical. Additional orders will be given as the situation develops. Theta, Iota, and Tower wings will be on alert level 30. Delta and Epsilon wings are on alert level 15, and Alpha, Beta, and Gamma wings will be on alert level 5. Additionally, all returning spaceworthy fighters from Task Force Alpha will be placed on alert 10 in case we need additional support during the strike. Pilots, this may be our only chance of keeping Rybos. The Sheevans continue to pour in from Achaea, and Command has deployed the GTT Galatea and its battle group to blockade the node. But, we do not know how long a single battle group will be able to hold the node. If this attack fails, GTA High Command has issued standing orders to retreat from Rybos and do everything we can to ensure the evacuation of all military and civilian personnel within the system. I don't believe I need to tell you what is at stake here, pilots. Dismissed. Alright pilots, listen up. We'll be launching sooner than expected. Task Force Alpha has ran into far more resistance than anticipated. The Sheevans have called in three additional cruisers, as well as several fighters and bomber wings. They have Task Force Alpha pinned down and Command has ordered Task Force Beta to move forward with the assault and rescue. Alpha, Beta, and Gamma Wings. Your ships are ready in the fighter bay, and we're going in first. Our objective is to move in and engage the Sheevan swiftly, to give Task Force Alpha cover to withdraw. The GTC Hammer, the GTC Tear, and the GTC Pitch will jump in to engage the enemy cruisers, but it will be some time before they can close the distance to engage. Delta and Epsilon Wings, you will launch as soon as your ships are ready and join up with the rest of Task Force Beta. Theta, Iota, and Tau Wings will be on standby. We don't have much time, so report to the fighter bay. On the double, pilots. Dismissed. All Wings, move in. Protect those cruisers. Monitor, got a Shivan Bomber Wing closing in on your position. Engaging enemy. This is the GTC monitor. We are moving to disengage. Pilots, cover us. Cruisers 
defenders are moving into a defensive position. We have to pick them off before they manage to regroup. Alpha 1-9, watch out for those missile launchers on the SCT bus. We only managed to take out one of them. Impressive, pilot! No hostiles in the- Good luck. Attacking now, sir. Pilots, we are moving in to engage the remaining Sheevan cruisers. Delta Wing has arrived, awaiting orders. Attacking now, sir. Epsilon Wing has arrived. Delta Wing, engage the cruisers. Epsilon, cover Delta. Attacking now, sir. Engaging now, sir.
Affirmative, sir. Attacking now, sir. Rearming complete, sir. All Sheevan cruisers have been eliminated, man. Well done, pilots. We are making the final preparations now. Alpha Wing, stand by. Two Shivan cruisers with fighter escort have just arrived, the SC Naidu and the SC Arjuna. Roger, disregarding your target. We have a launch from the Lucifer. All wings, stay close to the cruisers. Yes sir, Attacking disregarding now, sir. target. Engaging now sir. This is the GTC Hammer. We are engaging the enemy cruisers. Affirmative, sir. Taking damage. Request cover. New bandits in the area. This is the GTD Bastion. We are launching all remaining fighters now. Destroy those cruisers, pilots. We have to clear a path before we commit our bombers. Enemy wing just arrived. casualties command. Enemy wing just arrived. Taking damage. Request cover. Took out the SC Naidu. Roger, sir. On our way. The 
SC Arjuna has been eliminated. The Shebans are already pressing the IKEA blockade. We're running out of time. We are deploying the bombers now, pilots. Make sure they reach their target. Heads up, we have company! Rearming complete, sir. This is Lambda Wing. We are setting course for the Lucifer's engines. in the area. GTSC you doing here, we are now in position. GTSC, you're done. Report. Readings on that energy spike. Affirmative, sir. Affirmative, Krios. It looks like some kind of energy-based planetary bombardment weapon. Taurus Wing is targeting the bombers. Intercept them. We are readying our jump drive, just in case. Admiral Shima, I recommend you do the same. You got a bogey on your tail. Already ahead of you, Admiral Scott. This is Lambda. We are in range. Heads up! We've got visitors! Omega, we are opening fire. Negative impact command. We're not scratching those shields.
Galatea. This is the GTD Krios. The assault is not going as planned. We are preparing to disengage and proceed with the evacuation of Rybos. Please acknowledge. Acknowledged, Krios. We will proceed with the evacuation as planned. Medusa wings. Abort mission and proceed to the following coordinates. Roger, command. We're getting out of here. Enemy wing just arrived. All cruisers, pull back towards our position. Jump out now! Jumping in near the Lucifer. A second Sheevan cruiser has just arrived. Heads up! We've got visitors! This is the GTD Galate. A demon class destroyer has just jumped in from IKEA. We cannot hold our position any longer. We are withdrawing. A third Cuban cruiser is entering the field. Acknowledge, Galate. Proceed to rendezvous point Echo and regroup. Heads up! We've got visitors! Cruisers, disengage and jump out now. Engaging enemy. Alpha 19, we are transmitting jump coordinates now. Meet us at the rendezvous point. GTD Bastion, out. Losing system, help me out! Krios. We are jumping out now. Our pilots, abort mission and return to base. New hostiles in the area. This is Alpha 19. All wings, return to base.
We did what we could, but it wasn't enough. We never had any chance. Even if the tsunami bombs had worked, we didn't nearly have enough bombers or bombs to inflict meaningful damage on the Lucifer. At the very least, we had to try. We must study the Lucifer and try to understand its shieldings, how it reacts to our weapons. We must find a way to overcome it. We will strike again in the future, even if the cost is high, because we have no other choice. Of course, I could not tell them that. I could not tell those brave souls I sent to their deaths that Ribus was lost, no matter their endeavours. I could not tell them that they were risking all their lives for a gamble. A leader gives to his people hope, and it is with hope in their hearts that I sent them into the Crucible. Guy sent me a message after the battle. She told me what happened at the IKEA jump node. I'm relieved that they are still alive. I have lost many friends and colleagues today. She also told me how the Terrans and Vesudans fought together, how the Galatea and Pinnacle, their pilots, came together to fight the Shivans. For the first time in our history, we were able to set aside our differences and fight together as allies. Maybe this is the way? I know many people inside the GTA that would bombard Vesuda Prime from pole to pole if it were their decision to make. It's not going to be easy to forget the last 14 years. The atrocities committed. But after what transpired today, I think I'm ready to try. The Bastion is en route to Sirius. Shivan scouts have been sighted in the system, coming from Regulus. So we fight on. This is Commander Williams, CAG of the CTD Bastion, signing off.